Hi there, welcome to Coffee Time with J&J. Looking forward to spending this time with you. So let's get started. Thank you, Lord God, for this day, Lord. I pray that you would go before us, Father, and you would order our steps, Lord God. I pray, Lord, that you would bring the transformation to our hearts, souls, and minds through the consumption of your word being read today. I pray that you would give us insight and wisdom beyond our understanding. Thank you, and we bless your name in Jesus' name. Amen. So, I'm so excited that the Lord continues to have me on this journey, and I'm excited to be a part of your journey of discovering more of who He is in His character. So, today we're going to read from 2 Corinthians, 2 Corinthians chapter 5, verses 6 and 7. Therefore, we are always confident and know that as long as we are at home in the body, we are away from the Lord. For we live by faith and not by sight. So I want to talk about what is Paul saying when he's saying we're always confident and know that as long as we are at home in the body, we are away from the Lord. I believe Paul is um, directing it towards our physical body. As long as our physical body is here, present on this earth, we are not physically present with the Lord, so I'm just trusting that you gain an understanding from that, that this life here in the present is not all there is. There's more beyond here and being present, physically present here. So the next verse says, for we live by faith and not by sight. So we need to, faith is an action, and faith is something that involves the word trust, and Paul is saying here that he is living this life, and should we so choose to as well, that we live by faith, we don't live by sight. So a lot of times we can't focus on what we're seeing in our natural eye, but we're to trust in what we don't see because when we have a relationship with the Lord and we're reading His Word and putting into practice His principles and living by His commands, He has plans that are the best for us. And so we trust in those plans and, again, live every day knowing that this life is not all there is, and when I exit from here, I will spend my eternity with the one who formed me and created me. And God is so good and has so much in store for us beyond this earth that we're currently occupying. It's a beautiful creation. He did an amazing job when he created an environment for the ones that he loves, you and I. And so I would just encourage you today to have faith, no matter what you're going through, what struggles you're having, or even what joys and triumphs you're experiencing. Praise him, thank him, and continue to read his word and live by his commands. For those are the things that feed the spirit person who we are and allow for us to grow healthy and mature strongly and to live in the abundance of what he has for us. Thank you guys. Have a great day.